another vlog or another video rather uh, yeah welcome back to look Samawa so um, yeah if you're <laughs> welcome and if you're a returning subscriber thank you so much for being here with me and yeah I hope you'll stick with me till the end of the video and don't forget to like comment subscribe and keep sharing my videos with your friends and family so um, today I want to talk about I actually have to find a place to sit down in order for me to film this video but I just have to pick up my camera and start talking to you guys. So um, I want to share with you something that most of you has been, have been asking me about why I haven't been active on YouTube for the past couple of months. And yeah, I know it's been, um, it's been a long time actually, but we'll get there. So let me just find a place to sit down and then I'll talk to you guys, okay? So guys, yeah, I have sat down and yeah, I wanted to start with this video actually before posting anything But then I realized like I have all these vlogs lying around and I just couldn't afford I have actually shot this video a couple of times like twice if I could remember Yeah, I think I shot it that I shot it twice one. It was Right there. I could remember the time I was going out. So I just said I was waiting for someone there She asked me to wait to wait for her. So I just said why not take the opportunity to just do something, take a few clips. So I filmed it right there behind me. And then the other one, I shot it uh, in front of another faculty. I was working, I was just working. I just realized like, it's been a while I picked up my phone. So I just opened up my camera and started filming. Then I couldn't post it. I, don't, I just don't know what stopped me from doing that. I did not post those videos. So. Let's recap and start right from the beginning. I stopped making YouTube videos for almost five months. Yeah, I think a little over five months. I can I don't know the precise months, but I know it has been a couple of months. And honestly, thank you so much to, for to everyone that really checked up on me and asked why I haven't been filming. That really meant a lot to me. You guys, thank you so much for doing that. And you have no idea how that has encouraged me in order for me to get back at my feet. So, I was really down. I was, I almost, I don't want to say it. Because when I say it, it feels so real. I was so down and had little or no motivation in order for me to make videos. Because, as you all know, I've been juggling to find a place to film. Like a conducive place that would be okay for me to film a video. I've been struggling from hostel to restaurants to places anywhere like you just can't find Sudan is chaotic you guys it is it is a chaotic place and the struggle begins like from restaurant okay we started with restaurants I think we said that we mentioned that in our YouTube struggles the collab we had with Fauzi and Alia so I'll put up the link somewhere up here for you guys to watch after watching this video so yeah uh, I, when you go to restaurants, some they will ask you that you have to pay them in order for you to film. And yeah, some the restaurant is not even conducive for you to film. And then another thing is transport. Oh my God, you guys, I spend or like any YouTuber that goes to restaurant here in Sudan, I know they spend double the amount. Like they spend double amount on transport than they spend in the restaurant. Honestly, because it just. It just doesn't make sense like it's so expensive transport right here and so that really really uh, discouraged me from do like from just actually doing it and I just felt so down because everything around me was not encouraging like I uh, right from juggling from with school doing things so I just like it all got frustrating and I almost gave up that it reached to a point that I was thinking of deleting my channel yes I was thinking of deleting my channel because I got fed up with everything and I watched one of um, Ado Lifestyles video she's a youtuber she's an amazing youtuber she's into fashion lifestyle vlogs like you know a little bit of almost everything she's into you know I love her videos so 
uh, she mentioned she had something like this and she mentioned that she was so down about she is so down about the YouTube how YouTube works the analytics the SEOs and everything I'm still trying to figure that out too and like she almost gave up too and when I watched her bounce back to her feet she has no idea has that how that has affected me because seeing her for me she's a YouTube idol to me like I really look up to her on YouTube and then seeing her all down I, it got me thinking like Rooks this is a person that you really look up to on YouTube her videos inspire you to make yours to make your videos better and she's also having these mini episodes I wouldn't call them mini but she's also having this kind of YouTube issues I was like oh my god you're not the only one and anything that you're doing no matter how little it is you always face challenges on your way so it's up to you to either give up or bounce back as she did on her feet and Jamila Dora I am so I don't think I've ever told you this so if you're watching this video right now yeah I'm, I'm, I'm kind of tearing up gosh so if you're watching this video right now thank you so much for that because you've silently inspired me to continue yeah so Jamila's video really inspired me and just watching her silently from afar she has no idea how it has helped me and also the people that actually checked up on me a lot of people the first person that actually checked up on me was my dad and it's he checked up on me just like three weeks without me posting because then I have told him that I would be really consistent on my YouTube and blah 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 like we kind of talked something like that I don't even know if he remembers that but he called me one time and he's like Rooks are you okay why aren't you like why is your YouTube I don't see any notification of your videos is everything okay I told him oh yeah you know I'm just busy with school and it's so hard for me I'm just trying to juggle everything he's like okay just take your time but I know you love this and Take your time i know you'll you'll get back to your feet i'm like thank you and that also and that time when he talked to me i was not even thinking about um about quitting youtube it was just like me just you know laying back and see how things are going to turn out so after then people really started asking me how is it like you were not seeing me on youtube are you okay then i will just give them the excuse you know it's so hard school blah 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 just the normal excuse and that's it but deep down something in me was just telling me give up this is not for you like but something in me was still fighting that you started this and this is a journey that you had to make a decision to start i love making videos so much that i just couldn't give up then one day I think a month I think it was December yeah it was December 2021 at night I was working on my on my laptop then when I finished I wanted to you know shut down and sleep it was past midnight so I just looked at the folder that I had my YouTube videos in black rose so I opened it I started watching the videos one by one and then I realized Rooks this is the reason you started like when I was watching I was genuinely smiling from my heart like I felt I was so happy and I just had that drive that passion and that urge to just make something at that time if I had the um, if everything was to my own uh, if the situation was favoring me I would have made a video right there but no I didn't so I told myself tomorrow I'm gonna go out and make a video but then I didn't again like something starting but that moment when I watched my videos and I felt that the feeling all came back and I remembered why I started YouTube in the first place why I started making huge videos on YouTube everything like I just felt like okay no matter how no matter what you are definitely going to continue making your videos no matter what even if it means me doing voiceovers if it means me just putting on motion videos and just doing voiceovers and talking about whatever I want to talk about I don't care you're just going to do it you're not gonna give up so that was how I picked up myself alhamdulillah with the help of everyone and Allah's help I picked up myself and I in that moment I opened up my notes on my phone and I typed what I want to talk about and that was this video and I wanted to upload it first before even uploading that back to school vlog so yeah I would pretty much say that's the reason for my absence was everything was just so frustrating and not encouraging that it had pulled me down to a very 
state that I don't want to be back to, into because it was so hard for me to sometimes I would go to I would go somewhere and I would like think perhaps this is something good for you to vlog and then I would think no it's okay I'm not going to vlog it so that was it and I told myself something again I said uh, I was not going to upload any video on YouTube until I have five videos on ground so five videos means five weeks because I upload weekly right so yeah I couldn't you guys and during that period the, those five months that I was inactive on YouTube I actually make videos I would go out make videos but then no things will just work out the other way I remember making the independence video when Nigeria had its own independence last year I made a video I made actually two videos but then I the video turned out to be what I was not expecting it was so I got I got so mad that I was like okay it was during those moments that I would film videos and it wouldn't be up to what I want it wouldn't be what I expected they don't they will turn out to be something very bad or very terrible then I would I started developing those giving up thoughts I started developing the thoughts to actually give up on YouTube but then I didn't and alhamdulillah I am thankful that I didn't so I'm so grateful Right now, I'm even starting to have an, another idea. I think it will be a video for another day where I started YouTube in the first place because I don't think I've ever told anyone that or discussed it with anyone. So I'll definitely put that up video, perhaps later on. So guys, thank you so much. If you've watched this video till this place, thank you so much for, for sticking with me till this time. And I really appreciate you guys. So from now on i'm going to tell you guys you're just gonna see my videos anyhow me walking i'll pick up the camera and and start filming whatever it is i'm going to do like just me literally sitting down like this you'll see videos a lot like this so do bear with me if you see anything that is disturbing disturbing i mean in the sense that it's a background noise or something you have to bear with me because it's not easy and to every con content creator out there please do not give up if you have been to a place that i was before trust me it gets it gets good remember why why you started in the first place and yeah i think and yeah i just think that someone needs to see this video like i know there are a lot of youtubers like me out there who have been pulled down to a level where they don't feel they can go on even if you're not a content creator no matter what you're doing you might there would be um, instances in your life there would be times in your life where you, by you feel little or no motivation you not you feel that you're not doing you're not improving you're just stagnant you're not moving you're not doing anything please know that it gets better and it all starts with you the way you feel it's how you're going to react to your environment if you choose to look at it in a positive way you're going to go scale through it even though it took me a whole like a very long time to start looking at it the positive way trust me you will too if i can pull myself out of that with the help of allah and the amazing people i have out there youtube fam thank you so much for that encouragement just checking up on me it really meant a lot to me and yeah sudan is not encouraging honestly yeah one thing that oh my god it's at the end of the video that i'm just remembering this now I have this like I had planned this video and now I'm just all over the place the words are just floating out of my mouth my sister says I talk too much which it is I do but yeah I'm just gonna tell you guys one thing that actually uh, contributed to me not making the videos was when the internet was cut off I had the idea that I was gonna make video about how life was without the internet but then I just got bored and just got tired yeah that really also encouraged like that really contributed to me not making the video so what i'm gonna tell you guys is no matter how you feel if you feel really down or you're thinking about uh it's windy i don't know if it's disrupting the video audio or not i don't know so if you're thinking about quitting something remember why you started and look back at your journey how far you've gone look how far you've gone so Thank you so much for being with me till the end of this video i really appreciate you guys and thank you so much don't forget to like comment subscribe and keep sharing if you are in sudan and yes i will not stop hunting for a place to film if you are in sudan and you know a really cool place that i can go and film my content please drop the location down below and yeah don't forget to share this video with your friends and family and i think that's it so bye see you next when i pick up my camera bye